fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 9th of August 2023, late night here in Thailand. It's almost pushing Thursday. Um, in fact, by the time this video actually gets up onto the internet, it might well be Thursday. Uh, I'm pretty tired. I've done some work today, um, so I won't be spending too long playing this game. It means that I will switch to pencil marks very soon after playing, probably. Uh, I've heard of um, tech bros and cryptocurrency bros, and now we've got the cheese bro. Nothing to do with that dairy product, though. This one is uh, one of Trump's lawyers, uh, one of the crazy lawyers, um, and uh, a memo has been unearthed by the New York Times, secret memo uh, of the plot um, to... Uh, install Trump um, into the White House, reinstall him, I should say, like when you reinstall software, maybe uh, reinstall him into the White House after he lost. Um, so no doubt that evidence will be used. It's probably been already handled by Jack Smith um, at the upcoming trial. Let's hope that they don't wait too long to get on with the trial. The worst thing is the worst thing about this whole affair is the delay that has been going on and on and on. Uh, in the States. F there is no real justice if you have to wait for years and he's caused so much damage in the meantime. All right, let's get on with the game, shall we? I'm going to start with what I can see. This is Los Angeles Times expert level game. I notice immediately the seven and nine blocking up here, which is going to put seven and nine into those squares there. Let's, oh, my voice is a bit croaky today. I've been speaking a lot. I see the nines block down here and nine across there. That's going to give me nine there. Uh, and as for the sevens, well, that's going to put sevens in those squares, I guess. <clears throat> ah, we also have sevens up there. So sevens, uh, nothing much going on there. Uh, all right, so this is seven and nine. So here we're looking for one three eight and we've got a couple of threes across here like this so there's our three that we've got an eight going across there there's the eight and there's the one <clears throat> now let's try those numbers that we just put in see if we can get some more out of it yes one and three actually block down here so we're going to have one and three in those squares this then is going to be a five uh, missing numbers down here are f four and six. Yes, we've got six across here. So that's our six, that's our four. All right, let's have a look around. Uh, okay, three and six are needed for this column here, and obviously they're blocked from these two squares, so we have three and six in those squares there. We've got an intersecting six here, so that would be the six. That would be the three. And the other numbers up here are two... And I can't find the other number. What is it? Two, seven. So we've got two across there. That would be our two. That would be our seven. start counting again not counting but going through
five up there. Uh, so five and four here, five and four here. We've got a pair of four and five in those squares. Um, is that going to do anything much? Um, okay, yes, yeah, so seven blocks this square, so that's going to be a seven, and this would be our nine, and this would be a nine over here now. Nine blocking down here, nine across there, there's a nine. Eight blocks this square, there's our eight, this is our one. Uh, we've got eight blocking down here, so that's our eight. Four and six block across here. That puts four and six into those squares. This then will be a two. Um, two blocking down here and across here means that's a two. This would be one. One across here gives us one here with a three in that square. Three across here puts three there. Seven is the last number there. Um, six blocking across here. There's our six. This will be a four. Um, a one across here, across here, and up there will give us one in that square. The missing numbers here now are two and five. So we've got the two blocking across here. Here's the two, here's the five. And this is three, seven, eight. Three, seven, eight, one of each. Don't have any completed digits, surprisingly. So what's going on in the middle here? <laughs> it's rather a bold patch. Uh, I'm going to have to work out what goes in each of the <laughs> things down here. There's There aren't two digits up here, though, are there? So this uh, it's a bit... Uh, oh, one and three. Okay, one and three blocking down here, one and three blocking across here, one and three blocking across there. So we've got a pair of one and three there, so we can work out this. This will be an everlasting love. Four. So four blocking up here and four across here and there puts the four into that square. The last number here is five. Um, four now down, up, across, 
and across means that's a four. And that's our first completed digit. Oh, well, it was all going so swimmingly right until the end, and then I suddenly can't see. Um, I'm going to have to work out what goes up here. Okay, so here we're looking for one, we're looking for six and nine. One, six, nine. And this is two and seven. Hmm. Um, across here, we're looking for two, three seven across here we're looking for um three eight nine uh, across here we're looking for f five seven eight Across here, we're looking for um, five, six, nine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is one and three, I remember. Okay, so <laughs> I'm getting no, got, this is unreal. Um, two, seven, eight. All right, let's look down this way then. <laughs> um, there's a lot to uncover here. So it's uh, two, six, seven, eight, nine, right? Is that right? Two, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, I see two seven in this row, two seven in this row, two seven in this row. So it means that this square and this square are a pair of two and seven. Um, knowing that's two and seven, the three white squares contain uh, six. Eight and nine, I guess. <laughs> and that doesn't help me. Huh. 
huh. Well, I wasn't expecting this. It's like the Spanish Inquisition. Oh, I'm going to have to put the pencil marks in now. <laughs> it's so weird. All right, okay. Um, eights go there. Sevens go here. And threes go there. <clears throat> um, up here, we're looking for... Uh, one in those squares, uh, six in these squares, and nine anywhere. This was um, two and seven. Okay, down here we're looking for um, twos anywhere there. Fives there, and eights here. Uh, this is one and three. And over here we're looking for... F oh, I put fives down there, sorry. There's not fives there, take that pack. Um, fives are here. The missing number down here is seven across there. Sorry about that. Uh, five and sixes are here. And then nines can go anywhere. Right, and now let's finish this block here. So we've got twos in those squares. We've got threes in these squares. Um, we've got fives in these squares here. Sevens there. Eights here. Nine's there. <clears throat> okay, so we had a pair of six, nine here, and therefore that is going to be eight. So eight is here, three is there, seven is there, two, three. nines um, get rid of this eight as well and that eight there and let's put an eight in this square here we have a pair of two seven and two seven here so then this is going to be five Seven is there. Two, seven, two, seven. Five. That's it for the Los Angeles Times game for my Sudoku at bedtime. And it definitely is past my bedtime now. Bye-bye.